What is up guys, it's Cal, and in this video I'm going to show you how to farm Ancient Mana in WoW. So just a little description of it if you're unaware, Ancient Mana is a currency used in Suramar for the Night Fallen. You can buy various things, I think there might be companions, there might be pets or something, there's like these plushies that cost 100 mana, don't buy the plushies, that's a waste of 100 mana. It's also used as the life force for the Night Fallen, it's like a substitute for cocaine, I don't know what they use it for, but you can't seem to do any quests in this zone without it. Also, once you're level 110, every three days there is a scenario called like the Withered Training Camp or something, and the more Ancient Mana you put into that, the better you can do in that scenario, and I'm probably going to put up a video on my experiences with it and a good route that I took with that scenario and so forth, but that's later on. But anyway, this video is going to show you how to farm that stuff. So the first thing you want to do is go to the Twilight Vineyard in Saramar City, right there on the map, and it's going to be all along that path. And you want to put your Masquerade on, it makes everything a whole lot easier, so then you won't really get detected. As you see there, I currently have 441 Ancient Mana. That's to show you how much I will have at the end, how much I gained over the process. And I put the stopwatch on because I want to see how much I get in 5 minutes. So early on in the Suramar quests, you will get an item that lets you track Ancient Mana, which I have on currently, and it shows them up as like gold dots on your map. You're definitely going to want that for this, so then you'll be able to see all of the things in the Twilight Vineyard that can give you ancient mana. Because there's like flowers, there's wine, there's other stuff that has ancient mana with it. And some of them give like 120, like close to 200 amounts like that. And you're just going to run up and down the Twilight Vineyard and pick up everyone that you see on your map. Now I am on a fairly active server, so while I was doing this I was noticing that there are a few other people that were picking up ancient mana the same time as me. But I was still able to get a lot because these things don't really have long spawn timers, which allowed me to get the amount of ancient mana that I got at the end. So we're coming up to the end here, and I guess one other thing I should note is that when you start in Suramar, uh, the max amount of ancient mana you can have is like 300, somewhere around that. Uh, but there are various ways to increase that cap, like from quest rewards, or there are things that you can pick up, and so on and so forth. So here we are at the end, coming up to the last uh, thing of ancient mana, I think it's powder or something. And there we go, that is five minutes. So I'm going to check how much ancient mana I have. Any second now, there we go. I have 1192. So that's like uh, 750 or 751, I think, ancient mana that I collected over that five minute period. So you can easily cap out your ancient mana with this method. But I hope that helped you guys out. You can leave a like on this video, sub to the channel. I'm going to start doing more WoW tutorials because I feel like people like those have gotten some positive feedback from them. So yeah, I will see you guys in the next video.